Hey what's up guys Rana back with another exciting video and in this video guys I'm going to show you how you can create a free Amazon affiliate website with WordPress so that you can make some cash with those free website. So guys basically what we're going to do here we will connect Amazon affiliate account with our WordPress website in order to import products directly from Amazon into our WordPress website. So like I said we will create free website with free domain and free hosting. If you want to buy a paid hosting or paid domain, you can do that as well. And the rest of the work will be the same. So if you want to give a try, you can do that as well. So anyways, enough talking and let's get started. Let me show you guys how you can create a free Amazon affiliate website. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe or you can turn on notification by clicking this notification bell icon and you won't miss my new uploads. And also you can leave a like if you've been enjoying these videos so guys let's get started and let's create a free amazon affiliate website go to google and perform a google search for byte host so open up this website in a new tab meanwhile perform another google search for free noun and open up this website in a new tab this website gonna provide us free hosting and here we can get a free domain so let's get it and here you need to sign in so I'm gonna quickly sign in so guys I recommend you to log in via email sometime social login doesn't work so now go to services register a new domain here you can type your domain now click on check availability so guys these are the free domain and these are the paid one so in our case we need a free domain then click on get it now then click on checkout now click on use DNS now click on use your own DNS now change the time period 12 month free so guys leave this page as it is now we need name server of this website let's go back here let's sign up for hosting click on sign up for plan here you can type your domain this is gonna be subdomain don't worry you can type anything you want we will replace this domain with our domain now complete this registration process now give your real email now we need to check the email so guys as you can see they send us the verification email now verify our account by clicking on this link so guys as you can see account has been created successfully now we can access our cPanel by going to this link this is your username of your cPanel you can copy and you can paste here and enter your password here and log in quickly so guys this is the cPanel now let's scroll down and then click on add on domains under the domain section so guys these are the name server we need to copy them now let's go back to this free now website and paste here paste down here as well and let's change this number one to two and then click on continue let's move on to the rest of the work so here you can type your billing information if you like otherwise check this box and click on complete order let's go to client area go to the services my domain so guys this is the domain that we just uh, get it for free let's copy this now go back to the cpanel and paste your domain right here and make sure guys you don't have any space in the beginning or in the end of the domain and then click on add domains so guys they show us error this is just because we just added the name server and name server sometimes takes time to reflect and uh, that's why they show us this error message if the same thing happens to you then don't be panic try this process five minute or ten minute later you will be good to go let's go back to the home and let's try again and let's see paste domain right here click on add domain okay guys as you can see now we successfully added the custom domain let's go back go back to the home now we need to install WordPress. Let's scroll down, click on Software Class Apps Installer. So guys, these are the script that we can install on this hosting. So we need WordPress, then click on install. So guys, here it says choose domain. Choose your custom domain. Do not choose subdomain. Delete this. 
here you can give a name to your site you can call whatever you like here you can change the description of your site here you can type username now type your password now here you need to enter your real email address now scroll down then click on install so guys wordpress installed successfully now we can access our wordpress dashboard by going to this link So guys our first step is done. Now let's move on to the next one which is we need an Amazon affiliate account. Let's go back to the Google. Type Amazon. So guys I am from India. So address is a Amazon.in. If you live in another country address might be different. So let's open up Amazon. Let's close these tab. So guys you need to scroll down. Now here you need to click on become an affiliate. So guys here you need to sign up you can join the Amazon affiliate program by clicking on this link I already have account on this so I'm gonna log in so guys as you can see I just log in with my Amazon account once you log in now let's leave this page as it is let's go back to the dashboard let's go to the appearance theme then click on add new now search here Astra. Now install this theme. Now click on activate. Now go to plugins. Add new. Now search here Astra. Now install this Astra starter sites. Install now. Then click on activate. Now go to the appearance. Then click on Astra sites. Now you wanna go to Beaver Builder. So guys here you can choose any theme you like but theme should be included WooCommerce plugin scroll down so I'm gonna choose this theme so guys as you can see this is the demo of this theme so we need to install these plugins as well click on install plugins so it'll take some time so I'm gonna speed this video up a few moments later now click on import this site and click on OK now it will import all the demo data of this website now it will import the media from this demo website so it will take some time so I'm gonna speed this video up uh. so guys as you can see now we are done here now click on view site so guys this is the website that we just built now click on customize so guys if you scroll down you can see we don't have buy now button here let's add that button let's go to the layout WooCommerce shop and then check this eyeball icon and now you can see the add to the cart button then click on publish now close the customization let's go back to the dashboard let's go to the plugins click on add new then click on upload plugin so here we need to upload a plugin so let's go back to the Google and here search for Wuzon Wuzon light version open up this website and then download this plugin I already have this plugin so I'm not gonna download this again let's go back to the cPanel now look for FTP account open this up so guys now we need a FTP client so I'm gonna use FileZilla to upload that plugin so let's open FileZilla if you don't have FileZilla you can download FileZilla go to the Google type FileZilla open up this first website and download FileZilla client you can download for Mac or you can download it for Windows according to your Windows version if you have 64 bit you can download 64 bit if you have 32 bit you can download 32 bit so once you download and install this into your computer then open this up so I'm going to open my FileZilla so guys this is the FileZilla so guys now we need to log in into our web server in order to log in we need a host name username and password and port now let's go back to the cPanel this is the information of our FTP let's copy this one by one so I'm going to add all this information into my FTP client which is FileZilla
then click on quick connect so guys as you can see now we inside our server now let's go to your domain now click on HD docs inside the HD docs we need to open WP content then open plugins so here we need to drag and drop our plugin that we just download so guys this is the plugin that we download and this is the zip file we need to extract it right click extract here so guys now we have this folder if you open this up these are the plugin files now let's step back and we need to drag and drop this entire folder right here this uploading takes some time so I'm gonna speed this video up and I will come back once it's done one hour later so guys we almost done alright now plugin is upload successfully now let's go back to the dashboard now go to the plugins and then click on installed plugins scroll down and you can see WooZone light plugin now click activate now let's just config this plugin click on get started this is a setup wizard not asking what kind of site is so I'm going to select online store click next this is a fresh install click next here I'm going to choose the second option then next click next click next next so guys here we need to enter the access key ID of Amazon affiliate account and secret key. So let's go ahead and open Amazon affiliate account. Now here go to the tools then click on products advertising API. So guys you can create your access key by clicking on this add credential button. So this is your access key. Now copy the access key by control A select all copy. Let's go back to this plugin paste right here. Let's go back to Amazon again. Copy your secret key. Control A. Copy. Let's go back to this plugin and paste here. And next, you need your affiliate ID. Let's go back to your Amazon affiliate account. So, this is your Amazon affiliate ID. Go to your accounts, your email, and then click on manage your tracking ID. Now copy this. Let's go back here. So I'm from India. I'm going to paste just in this section. And then I'm going to change the country India right here. And I'm going to change this to India. And then you can click on check Amazon AWS keys. If this doesn't work for you guys, then make sure you have account on Amazon AWS let me open up a new tab when you go to the Google type AWS Amazon and then open up this website aws.amazon.com here you need to create account when you create account it will ask you for credit card or debit card and it will charge you only two rupees two Indian rupees and that's uh, almost a free once you have account on this website then you won't face any sort of error now click on check Amazon AWS key okay as you can see it says WooCommerce Amazon affiliate was able to connect to Amazon with Pacific AWS key pair and associate ID and now click on finish now close this now dismiss this notice so guys as you can see now we inside the WooZone plugins dashboard first of all this is a free version with the free version you get uh, limited features if you have paid version you get tons of other features with it so guys now let's just import products from Amazon in order to do that let's click on insane import mode here you can type a keyword like uh, you can type shirt and uh, I'm gonna choose shirt for men select the category apparel and I'm gonna scroll down I'm gonna click on launch search and uh, 
this will do some process here and this is the result that we have here so again guys this is a free version of this plugin if you have a paid version then you can import many products in one click anyways once we have these products you can select specific one or you can select all of them scroll down and then click on import products and uh, it will take just few seconds as you can see because these are only 10 products now close box go to the store let us go to the t-shirt and polos open this up and uh, these are the t-shirts so let's try this out so I'm going to click on a select option now select the color which is black available select the size and then click on add to cart and let's see what's going to happen and then click on view cart alright don't worry about the currency you can change it under the WooCommerce settings now click on proceed to checkout so guys as you can see we just redirect in Amazon with this plugin so how cool it is right so this way you can add tons of products on your website let's go back to the dashboard alright guys now let me show you the paid version of this plugin so guys this is the paid version of this plugin if you buy this you will get six months of support and uh, variety of features you can see right here and you can see the sale many people are using this plugin to increase their revenue if you are serious about this you can buy this otherwise you can use the free version of this plugin alright guys I think we done everything here we created our Amazon affiliate website alright guys that's the end of this video guys I hope you enjoy if you did enjoy this long video then you can hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that being said goodbye and see you next time